Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I am back with some new products. I did do a drink or a Trek store haul. And then um, I actually kind of uh, got some stuff off of Amazon as well. And so I'm really playing with the, the baked products today. And so most of everything I have on is going to be a baked product. And I've forgotten how much I really like those. So we'll go ahead and get started. And as far as what I have on for my base today, I did go ahead and pick up the e.l.f. bronzing drops. These are in the rose gold. And I mixed it with the Maybelline Superstay C+. I have mine in 102. I think that's the lightest shade. And so I did go ahead and mix these. I actually ended up adding more of the rose gold. Um, it's kind of, uh, it wasn't what I was expecting. The formula is really thick, so it's not really a drop. It's more like a thick lotion. And I actually ended up adding in more of these than I thought that um, I was going to need. And I still, yeah, I don't think it looks like too much. Um, I think I pretty much in a match right now. Oh, I did need to let you know I did do some self tanning, but that was about half a week ago, three, four days, so that's not brand new either. And so anyway, this is one of the new products that I have. And as far as what else that I have on the face today, um, <clears throat> I did go ahead and use a uh, baked uh, bronzer. This is one of the Revolution ones. It's the Bronzer Reloaded, the Holiday Romance Bronzer. And it does have some shimmer in it. Um, it is what I have on as far as my bronzer today. And as far as blush, I went ahead and used a baked product for that too. This is the F or the Essence and this one is pretty, pretty peach. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. And so this is what I have on as far as uh, my blush today. And it's a really pretty light peach kind of color. I did go ahead and use the ColourPop Liquid Lights. This is the lightest liquid highlighter. I think they have three shades and so I have the lightest one on there. Really enjoying that. Another um, the product that I went ahead and picked up was the Pretty Fresh, and this is a concealer by ColourPop. Uh, they have these over at Ulta, which makes it, and over at Target. So um, it's one of my favorite concealers. It has a whole lot of hyaluronic acid in it, and so it doesn't feel drying. And so I like this one a lot, and that's what I have on there. Again, I did go ahead and pick that up again. Um, an older product that I'm actually using on the brows is going to be the e.l.f. pencil. And this one is in light brown, so that's what I have on there. I did go ahead and use the Call Me Queen as far as the uh, mascara. And this is a new mascara from Essence. Really liking that one as well. And then what I did for the lips was I went ahead and got these lip glosses. They're over at Dollar Tree. And they're a dupe for the vinyl, um, actually the vinyl lipsticks. And then they came out with the lip glosses as well. I have the lip gloss in the peach on today. And then I did go ahead and add in a little of the e.l.f. lip oil. And this one's in jam. So, yeah those two on right now. As far as the rest of the baked products that I have on, um, I did go ahead, well actually let's go to this one first. First, the all over face powder, the Physician's Formula Butter Glow and Translucent. Again, another baked product. And all of these are baked products from the, um, yeah, here it is, uh, from the drugstore. And a couple of them are new. The peach is actually a new color that I just picked up. Um, but this line is really good, and this powder is really good. And so, yeah, um, 
I'm enjoying my baked products, and um, and I'm enjoying them even more that I don't because I don't have to pay an arm and a leg for them. They've filtered down, and so now they're available in the affordable formulas. And as far as eyeshadow and being baked, um, PH Cosmetics, it's now uh, that was bought out by Revolution, was really known for going ahead and doing the baked eyeshadows. Laura uh, Geller does some now, but BH Cosmetics did a lot of palettes with baked eyeshadows. And you don't see that as much anymore. And so when I saw this one on Amazon, it's Ever Favor Professional Makeup. And I was just like, yeah, somebody's still doing these because they're some of my favorites. And um, so this is what I picked up, and I think it was like thirteen fifty on Amazon, and so um, they really have a lot of, mm, excuse me, staying power, which is what I remember one of the reasons why I liked them so much, and I wore them yesterday, and they definitely stayed. So uh, what I have on today is going to be this color right here, and I have that on the outer corner, and then on the inner corner I have this color right here, and I have a little bit of the white uh, right, uh, right on the inner corner from about here up to here. So um, yeah, pretty, pretty uh, color scheme. These ones over here, and they have a blue base spread a they're mixed with either a warm brown or um, a gold or a cool brown, all three of these colors over here. And so you'd think that they'd be more blue, but they show up brown, which I just thought I'd let you know. Um, the other colors are pretty much true to color. They are mixed, um, so even though you have a purple right here, there's a little bit of white shimmer in there uh, with this yellow here it has a little bit of pink in it so um what well what i do is i go ahead and uh, mix my finger in the shade like that and then i go ahead and put it on with my fingers you can go ahead and use a brush too but i've always found that it was just really easy to go ahead and apply these like that and they're just really pretty and i'm really glad that i found them because it's been a while since um, I had any since, you know, BH Cosmetics went out of business. And so if you're looking for some, I uh, definitely would go ahead and recommend. And I've got yeah, finger marks all over it. Um, the Ever Favor. And again, this one you can find on Amazon. Really liking this formula a lot. And it really stays because I had a long day yesterday at about a 12th hour day and they stayed on. So I was really happy about this, that. This is a liquid eye, eyeliner by Avril. And oh, um, if you're hearing something, they're working on the yard outside. But this is Avril like this and this is a multi-chrome eyeliner it's what I have on usually I stop my eyeliner about midway but I took it all the way today into the inner corner and all across the bottom so that's a little bit different and I took off um, some of the shadow from right under the brow as well this way that the look came out and so that's the way that that looked. And as far as um, going ahead and being a multi-chrome eyeliner, uh, this one, the Averell, I got off of Timu. I'm finding that it's a really good formula that you can actually see some of the multi-chrome. I have a couple of multi-chrome eyeliners that you really can't tell. But with this one, it has a lot of shimmer, and in um, different lighting, it'll actually show up different colors. I thought what I'd do is go ahead and add a little bit of the white back into here a little bit. Let's we'll see what that does. If it, I had the uh, turquoise going all the way up and it was a little bit much, but let's go ahead and put a little bit of the white on and see what that does. So here's the white color right here.
Yeah, it gives it a little bit of shimmer. So there we go with, and that's how it looks with a little bit of the white shimmer right under the brow. And yeah, pretty, pretty, pretty. Again, that's um, Everfavor Professional Makeup, and you can get that on Amazon. Um, I think everything else um, is all drugstore over at Alta, or Target, or Walmart. And again, the Avril you can get on Tamiu. Um, other than that, I think that that's a video for today. I definitely recommend baked formulas. They tend to be made in Italy, and um, they just, it, with my skin type, which is combo, um, my T-zone is still pretty oily, but everything else is more normal at this point. Uh, so, yeah, it definitely stays on with my skin type, so I think it'll probably work with just about any skin type. And, um, yeah, that's the video, and I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you later. Bye.